When we started performing endovenous surgery back in 1999, we'd find that when we were introducing devices, they would often get caught about this level, and quite often blindly, without the ultrasound, we could improve things just by passing the knee forward like this, sometimes straightening it, and by just doing this a few times and bringing it back and guiding it, we could quite often get round different areas that the knee were complex uh, anatomy. We never ever had to use guide wire to get through that point. Now sometimes we do find that in the mid thigh or lower down, we actually have a point that we can't get past with simple maneuvers like that. In these situations, we then put the ultrasound onto the catheter. We will find the vein and we'll quite often find uh, some sort of uh, tributary or perforator and by using different techniques such as pushing from the left or pushing from the right quite often if we also go into ultrasound transverse so if we go into that channel, thank you so quite often if you can see it this way around you can see that you're still in the lumen you can also use your fingers once again to push from the left and push from the right and one of the very good tricks here is if we have to move it when we know the ultrasound at this level here, if we push about 10 centimetres below to the left, we know that the, the end, this end goes to the right, and vice versa, push on this side, it bends, so we can actually direct the end just by pressure on the skin, using the ultrasound to guide us. So if you ever get stuck, the first thing to do is look to see why you're stuck with the ultrasound, to see if there's a web or, or uh, it's gone into the wrong vein such as a perforator or a tributary and you can obviously pull it back and guide it. Second thing, before you start pushing or pulling with your fingers just bend the knee and straighten the knee and keep passing it in and out with different angles and you'll usually find that gets round and thirdly the other thing to do then is put the ultrasound on and use the manipulation of the skin particularly 10 centimeters back to try and bend the front of the catheter into where you want it to go. If you find you really, really can't get through, don't get frustrated about it all. Say you get stuck at this point here and you really can't advance any further, that's no problem. As long as you haven't put tumescence in, you can then put the ultrasound here and do a second entry point and just treat the vein as if you're treating two veins sequentially.